What's up guys, Sterling again here. Welcome to another React video. Well, today, uh, before we talk about Fragment, which I'm really excited about, but let's kind of review what we talk about, okay? We talk about how for you guys to get started with JSX. Nothing crazy, just get your JSX up and running, okay? Now, today we're gonna be talking about React segment. One thing we've learned so far about JSX is we have to have everything inside a container. If you guys haven't watched this, definitely watch out my previous video, which means if I want to have another element, I cannot have two element next to each other like this. Okay. Everything has to be inside a massive container. Now it doesn't matter what your container is. You can, it can be anything. It could be a P tag, a section tag, whatever it is. It could even be a header tag. Like the, it doesn't matter what your component is. That ma What matters is it has to be inside a parent, okay? For example, we have a parent now called div element, which has these two element. If we if we inspect this element, we will now see this, you see that? It's inside the root, and now it's inside the div and inside the test. Well, what if we did not want to have a parent element? We wanted to just have the two div, like this two element next by each other. What we can do in case is we can use something in JSX called React Fragment. And it goes like this. And it goes like this, guys. And then you paste your element inside of it. What this does is this provide for you an empty element that doesn't have anything inside of it where you can technically wrap, wrap up or aka put all your div inside of this element which does not contain anything and at the end of the day you end up having something like this ladies and gentlemen this is the reacts fragment now one thing i also want you to be mindful about in one of the latest version of releasing queer react app because this is what we are currently using you will be able to do this which means if you don't have it you have this empty thing it will also be considered as a react fragment it will be working this is something to be mindful about and stuff like that now you might be wondering okay sterling i understand this this makes sense but what is everything that you can do with jsx what is like what are the things you can do with jsx while well, we're gonna explore it in the next video